For most people, you would think that a $37 million mansion is what dreams are made of, but not when it's LeBron James. LeBron recently purchased a Beverly Hills home for $37 million only to tear it down and build it up from the ground up. We all know that's chump change for the NBA mogul who just signed a two-year $97.1 million contract extension with the Lakers. Well, fans, they're not taking it too kindly. Some fans think it's flexing to do what LeBron is doing and others think it doesn't make sense when all he has to do is have a home built. The purchased property was originally built in 1934 and previously owned by Hollywood actor Charles Boyer. It then changed hands to aviator and film producer Howard Hughes. But it didn't stop there. Howard leased the home to his lover, Catherine Hepburn, in the 1950s. By 1986, the house was purchased for $2.9 million by soap opera icons William and Lee Bell, who both co-created The Young and the Restless and The Bold and Beautiful. Wow, the price of that home quadrupled times three or four since 1934 when it was built. I mean, this home has gone from $2.9 million in 1986 to $37 million during the time that LeBron wants to purchase it. So, guys, what do you think? Do you think LeBron is just flexing because he has, has the money to do it? Or do you think he should just have something totally rebuilt from the ground up instead of tearing it down let's talk about it in the comments guys and as always thank you so much for listening and don't forget to like share and subscribe bye guys